Drake's a punk ass. Right. Fuck you. <laughs> You're a hater. <laughs> I'm a hater. Camera radio. Listen, I don't hate. Yes, I congratulate. You know what I mean? Day. I don't day. listen. You, you know, when people throw a lot of words around like love and genius and fucking amazing and brilliant but those Ooh. words need to be dumbed down we need to stop we need to the market is oversaturated with congratulatory fucking spell words it. i don't know how to spell that see i know what I'll, it I'll means just take a correct pronunciation you know? <laughs> right <laughs> It's always saturated with love and shit. Like, I think, like, the word no builds character. You know what I mean? Is this good? No. Can, Can somebody I turn this mic off? No. Anywho. <laughs> turn this mic off. Back to me. <laughs> What's the long <laughs> problem? <for? laughs> so, no, for the, so I'm bringing you guys this week the good, the bad, and the... Huh? So, for the good... Going back to Cali, Oakland, one of my favorite places that I'm I've never going, been. Going back. Oakland has now moved their minimum wage from nine dollars to twelve twenty-five. So when you work at McDonald's. That is a big ass that hike. That's a jump. I expect is, is if I go to Oakland. Or is it no, that's official. If I go to Oakland and I go to Wendy's and I tell you, give me a junior bacon cheeseburger, <laughs> no tomato and ketchup and onions, and I get my burger and it has a tomato <laughs> on it, I'm going to go in and I'm going to throw it at you. You're going to go off? For that twelve ninety five. dollars <laughs> You should. Twelve twenty five. You Too much. Too much. <laughs> you should be able to do that for me. I'm going to keep it an OG. Because I used to work at Wendy's. Oh, I used to work at Wendy's too. And ratchetness. Listen, <laughs> I used to work the night shift. Oh, I worked the night shift too. <laughs> and Damn, when those drugs come through there, said, nigga, I want a big man. <laughs> <laughs> They like we don't sell that here. They like, fuck you, nigga. <laughs> With my big mat. That's what you wish to God you got paid more. I never had no, no. no, I'm not saying they don't I'm not saying they don't deserve it. But now that you're getting paid enough that you shouldn't have to be stressing about your bills, my sandwich should be paid made right. That's all I'm saying. I you agree with that. And here's the back. thing. If they don't adhere to their their increase in pay, they will be fired. Yeah. Like, yeah. If like you, you got you met your demands. Now there's gonna be more demanded from you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like, I right. want my stuff right. I want to get in and out in a minute. Well, I feel like that's not gonna happen. I feel like I feel like now that they're workers now. I worked at Wendy's. The Wendy's is not a hard job. I don't care what nobody says. It's not a hard job. Did you make sandwiches? I did it. Oh, I did it all. I washed dishes. <laughs> I made bacon. I took orders while making a sandwich, while packing the sandwich, and while sneaking in baked potatoes. For some of my friends. I did <laughs> And I used to have my makeup compact there too. So my face was on fleek when the I did it all. I, and that was when I was when I was 725. So trying to get chose from the window. Yeah, it was. She was out there like, this is Courtney, can I take your order? Yeah. Why yeah. yeah. you smell like a big Yeah, it was in you know, just But my to- face beat down. <laughs> Be on, and I'd be like, they would like, there would be like certain people I would know their voice, and I'd be like, sneak a little extra fry, little nugget. Because you, little, you were trying to get shows. I was getting shows. Oh, trying. get shows. You was getting banged out in the fries? No, I wasn't. Yes, I was. You said the worst employee ever. <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> definitely should have got twelve twenty five. Should have got fired. No, I was a really good employee. No, but but speaking on that, like like that uh like that increase is definitely going to make them seek like higher quality individuals. So yeah. like like Uncle Mix not getting hired. Yeah. Uncle yeah. Mick? Well that's that's a kind of an inside joke. But like <laughs> like there's certain there's certain caliber of people that can work for like five dollars an hour. You right. know what I mean? It's like you don't expect much of them. They gonna do <laughs> shady shit. They gonna steal. They gonna yeah. call off every Friday. Like but for five dollars an hour, those are the people you attract. And, right. And the other thing is sorry to interrupt. Go ahead. Uh, I'll give you the floor you hating. <laughs> <laughs> I was just gonna say that the the demand will go up for those positions as well, right, right. because now you have somebody that's like, oh, well, I can work at Wendy's, which apparently is an easy job, mm-hmm. and get paid twelve dollars an hour. The hours might be less though, you know, like if for five bucks an hour, you probably was getting like thirty two hours maybe. Now for twelve bucks, you probably only getting about sixteen. Yeah, I mean, th- there's a lot that goes into it. Yeah. So that was for the good. We'll see what happens. The bad is, um, I didn't. 
didn't see this man. This man was brought to me by my mom, but there was a little girl, two years old. She suffers from chromosome two duplication syndrome, which kind of sounds like Down syndrome, but whatever. She, um, there was, I guess her mom had took a picture at a celebration, she had turned two, and with this disease, you don't live that long. And I guess in celebration, her mom had took a birthday picture of her and sent it out to her friends. Next thing she knows, she's on Facebook and Instagram, and they're making memes out of the girl. Because the girl, she does, she she obviously looks like there's something wrong with her. But they were saying, like, what do you do, like, when your friend shows you a baby, a picture of their baby, and it looks like this. And just, like, like a black leprechaun and all this other stuff. And so, somehow, the magic of the internet, they found the family, and the family was just going on talking about, like, how they were really upset about it. Because it was really a celebration, they turned a good thing into a bad thing, blah, blah, blah. And my mom's conclusion, she was saying, this is why you don't put your stuff on Facebook or send stuff to your friends because they may not always be your friend. Mm -hmm. What do you guys think about that? That's shady, man. I mean, like, who are these monsters that would do that? To a child. Like, crazy. Like, like, yeah. So that was the bad. The good, I mean, the huh. I had a llama story because I liked the llama story because it was unjust. Because they arrested the black llama first. Oh, my God. Hold on, they arrested the actual llama? They had the, because they got, they was free, they was out. This is, okay, that's what, okay, you didn't see the llama joke. Yo. You know, there was two llamas that got, like, escaped, like, in Arizona or something, they were running. They got the black llama first, and the white llama, which was running all over the place. They the white llama. They finally politely apprehended the white llama. But there were, there were, I just want to say one joke that was on on Twitter that I saw, and it was my, like, if you have white friends, this is what they do, and I know you've done this before. So it was like, the black <laughs> llama and the white llama were like, they're supposed to be like out somewhere. And you ever be out with no, you ever be out with your white friends, and y'all know y'all doing something bad, and the police come, and there's a black person, you're like, oh shit, we about to go to jail. And the white person's like, no, no, let me talk, let me talk. And then the white person, he goes, Officer, I'm sorry. I didn't know we couldn't do this. My bad. My bad. And it was just funny. I just thought that was hilarious. I know a lot of people that do that. Like that. And, then, and then the llama going back was like, I knew we couldn't do that. <laughs> okay, right? So that's the first time. But the second time was the was the stupid ass black and blue dress oh that everybody. I don't know. Did y'all all see the dress? Yes. yes. What color did y'all all see? It was blue and black. Definitely black and blue. No doubt. Oh, okay. I thought you were Although I was scrolling, <laughs> I was scrolling one time. One time, I one saw this. Time I, did, I, did I see saw it. it. White, and white and gold. But you know who saw so it? You saw one time white and gold. But you know a lot of people who saw the white and gold. They was white. White people. Because white is evil. You know they saw white. White is, evil. Because white is right <laughs> and gold because they greedy as fuck. <laughs> Why you go? Why you go? The racism go? on this show is the <laughs> That's what you know what's funny it. though? They did a meme of uh, Akon. They was like, is he blue and black? Oh yeah. And then somebody was like, and I saw somebody was like, what if all this time black people were gold all this time? But I was like, that wouldn't be true because white people would find another way. Well, they were still they, us. Yeah. They're pretty yeah. valuable. Put us in slavery. Yeah. Yeah. Life. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that's it. That's it for me this week. So comment below. Comment Amen. below what Let color you guys saw or what, how you felt about the llama situation. The black llama. Oh, so the llama, the black llama was not <laughs> shot. <laughs> they kept saying there was a thing that they said the black llama was shot. The black llama was shot. He, resist oh, yes. <laughs> he didn't resist arrest. And there was photos of the llama on Twitter that they wouldn't show on the news. <laughs> <laughs> they sprinkled some oats on them. Yeah, they was like, they was like. Let's get out of here, Johnson. Alright, but yeah, so we'll be back after this. After this break. Shabai.